Check out that old international case tractor, buddy. Oh, yeah, this is worth it. I just turned on. Didn't do anything? Oh, it said the battery's dead. Well, that's because this is like a tractor graveyard, pal. The battery's dead in it. These are almost antiques by now. Battery's not dead. This thing's ready to go. Look at it says. Yeah, it says it's got a few problems, but hey, it's like your ticker. When you get older, your heart just doesn't beat as well as it used to. Hey, check out this throttle box over here. That is definitely old school. Oh, shoot, I forgot to turn the key off. Well, that's not a good thing. Problem with the tractor, but good. Oh, look at this old antique tractor. Do I have a key? Is there anything wrong? I saw the key. It's another Ford tractor. It is? It's a oh. Ford 2000. Wow. I'm sure it's not from the year 2000 by the looks of it. What do you think? This is probably early 70s, maybe? Probably. Boy, oh boy. Needs a paint job. Oh, wait. Look at this. Another John Deere. This is a 970, it's called. It's in a lot better shape than the Ford, but still looks like it uh, could use some TLC, definitely. Looks like that tractor needs a new roof, buddy. You know what kind of tractor it is? What? It's a Massey Ferguson. Oh, it is? We don't see too many of those around here. We're gonna have to see if there's a local dealer somewhere, but they still make them. Yeah, they do. And we see a lot of them at the old antique shows. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, this is John Deere country up here. Yeah. But boy, oh boy, look at the way they used to make these tractors, Blake. It looks, it looks like they've done a hard work for these. If you look at the engine, it looks like the whole frame is the engine, basically. And you know what? I bet that thing still works. This way to know. Ooh, that was a button sound. I wonder if this thing broke. It had to do on this, so it had to be broken. The radio did not want to work. Well, hey, we're not worried about the radios in here. We're trying to check out some old vintage tractors, buddy. Tractors that have radios get eliminated from the uh, video, so. I don't think that's a door, bud. I think you have one door on this one. It is. There's only one door. Look at that one right there. An international tractor. This thing's broken. <laughs> what do you think of the international? How's it look inside? Good, pretty good to me. Except for the seat. Yeah, the seat looks like uh, it's seen better days.
that would be more cool. That thing won't turn on the key. There's the radio and everything. That's a case. Get off my case, Blake. I'm talking about my case tractor, pal. And as usual, he doesn't oh, listen. Fire. That's a fire extinguisher, buddy. They do the same thing, though. What do you think? I don't know, buddy. This is more of a... I'd say a vintage, it's not an antique tractor. Yep, more radio stations. Oh, radio is right here! I'd still take it, wouldn't you? What? Still a nice tractor. That's a farm all tractor, Dad, buddy. Dad, look at the steering wheel. It's not hooked up to the wheels. Oh, uh, yeah. It's broken. Well, you know what? Some of these are probably just used for parts. Yeah. This one probably, this one is for you for parts. Oh, my God! Why? Look at that big one. Well, let's go see it. I don't know, is this an antique? Doesn't look too old to me. Ah! Is that a Kubota? I don't even know. It doesn't seem like it has its brand name on it anywhere. I don't know, we'll have to look that one up. Doesn't say what it is. Oh, plane, whale. This door, it's a new, this is a new old tool shop. And the door's already open and it got busted. Do you know what kind of tractor this is? It's a Ford tractor. Ford? It's like the Ford truck. This tractor is vintage. Is that a tractor? Yeah. It looks like it looks like a lift or a bucket truck or something. It's a John Deere. This is a John Deere. I don't know, buddy. This is a multi-purpose tractor. It's got everything. Look at the back. Look at all the fuses in this thing. Yeah. My goodness. Uh, yeah, this is definitely an old school John Deere.
There you go, buddy. Now, I think we can afford something like that. A used Kubota. I didn't think Kubotas were that old. They're old. I guess they've been around for a while. I'll have to ask the tractor tracker. He knows everything. Often confused with the John Deere because it's a green tractor, the Oliver tractor. Or some people call it the Olive tractor. These are nice. Yeah, Oliver. Looking okay. good. Put a grill on that thing. Yep. It's huge. It looks like it's a big, it looks like he got close to come to see good. Nice, buddy. That's an Oliver 1600. Can't beat that. Look at the engine on that thing. Tires look good. Boy, we could probably drive this thing right out of here. Nothing wrong with this, Oliver. That's one beautiful piece of machinery, isn't it? Next to a John Deere. It's probably the second favorite tractor. What do you think of that old dozer, buddy? But that even says. You don't even know what any of those gadgets mean. Oh God, I fell. But I'm all right. Don't worry about that. You better not. Don't even think about getting on my case again, Blake. Hey. Yeah, I know that joke got old real fast. Boy, oh boy. This, this is a very large old bulldozer and you know what i bet it still does damage blake it looks like it still has dirt and stuff down on the track so i'm sure this case is not out of commission what, that? what is it it's like, that's an old light i don't know probably probably is an old light that didn't make it fell apart. Yeah, it is. Well, that's going to do it for this episode of Tractor Tracker. I hope you got some good traction on that track. Wait, from the old school tractors, my hands got dirty. Oof. So dirty. Wow, I'd say. Hey, hey, hey. Thanks for wiping them on me, bud.